Hello my people, hope you're well, hope you're doing well. Now there's something I need to talk about just briefly because I've seen people uh, that are getting to farming being obsessed and it's good that we warn you about the traps, things to avoid. As I record this video, our onions are almost at uh, between 100 and 110. That is uh, by uh, business to business or if you're selling to bulk buyers to sell to retailers so retailers are buying at 120 shillings the same onions as some two months ago was almost 20 to 25 shillings so you can see there's a lot of these lot of uh, inconsistencies in prices when it comes to farming so how do you make the best out of this don't rush now to plant onions you're planting at 120 shillings my friend possibly the time in the next four months then it will be back to 20 or so. So don't wait and plant those things that you hear they're fetching high prices now and then you run and do or plant them. Plant them because you know how to take care of them. You know how to produce quality. Don't forget, market is good to pay attention to. But again, you need to bring in consistency. That is, when the prices are higher, you're in the market. When the prices are moderate, you're in the market. When the prices are high, then you can smile because you're still in the market. So you recover, you create a flat graph such that you can always have recovery period when it's just a peak, I'm there, I'm producing. So you say, I just segment your farm such that you have several products or different stages whereby products, if you're dealing with onions, we have some that are ready for the market. We have others that will be ready in the next one month or in the next three weeks so you just leave a time frame to keep you all through in the market so don't plant something because it is fetching high prices now or today so possibly tomorrow you'll be crying now it is not working so maintain consistent like i said in a previous video make sure you're there all through the year 366 days it's something it's a hard lesson that i've come to learn and when you have enough water, you can do it 366 days, 365 and a quarter days. So stay there 24 hours the whole year. Let those periods find you there and you're going to make the best out of it. So thank you very much. Just wanted to share that so that you're better than me. Remember to subscribe. I'll be doing more videos. I know I've been off a bit, but I'm preparing something good. This one was just for today. Thank you.